matter what job I had in the future, it would never be as bad as working at Amazon. Maybe that's why Amazon is experimenting with drones, because they work and they don't complain. <laughs> at the Jeffersonville, Indiana Fulfillment Center. When I was assigned to work in the pick department. I was going to be the one with the scanning gun and walking throughout the warehouse and then grabbing various items out of the bins. So it didn't sound too bad. Within my 10 hour shift, I would end up walking between 12 and 15 miles, which normally isn't a problem, but on the concrete floors, it took a lot of wear and tear. On my bones, on my tendons, it was bad. I felt something in the middle of my foot just crack. It was loud enough that I heard it. It hurt really badly, so I just toughed it out for those last 30-ish minutes before my break. And then I went down to, I guess what's kind of like their nurse's office, Amcare. And I was like, hey, something happened. There was a loud crack. I really think there's an injury. And they looked at it and they were like, well, we don't see anything wrong. Your foot's not swollen or anything. So just go to the dispenser, get some ibuprofen and then finish out your shift. It's either finish out your shift or go home with unpaid time. If you're giving a great customer experience, um, there's the only way to do that is with happy people. It was really just miserable. You can't do it with a set of miserable People. I've never had such a negative influence on my own health until I worked there. If I get a gift card, that's really the only time I'll buy something. I just feel bad for everyone else that works there. Because <laughs> maybe it's someone like me that hated their job, or maybe they'll break their foot. I almost felt like it was a huge prison cell because there were just little tiny windows that I could see the sun out of. I'm very proud of the culture that we have at Amazon. It just disturbs me because I know Jeff Bezos and the executive team at Amazon haven't ever worked one of those shifts before. If you worked a week in those conditions, it would have to change. Even me at the time being 19, it took a toll on my body, so I can't even imagine what it's doing to people who are older than me that work there. I wanna know what's going on in his head that makes him think it's suitable for people to work in conditions such as those. And the issue of, um, of working conditions I'm very proud of our working conditions.